Everybody. Um, I'm off to do something quite exciting which I'm gonna continue doing next week and I think that's it it's just one more shoot it's a secret shoot hush hush with someone that I absolutely love um, I've actually been involved in like the casting process and the ideas and things and it's been an absolute pleasure to work with this human on this project um, which will be launched hopefully later in September so you'll know about it I think you'll be excited about it but yeah, I'm going to go to um, do the shoot now and it's quite far away and I'm quite tired. It's quite early and it's gonna be exciting. I'm just gonna show you a time lapse because I probably won't be able to show you any more than that, but hopefully you'll enjoy it. I'm so excited for you to see it honestly um I hate doing this whole like secret project thing because as you know I've been going to London a lot in the past year I suppose for a secret project which you would have known if you'd seen my daily vlogs that hopefully I'm going to be able to tell you this month if not next month but I'm dropping hints on my Instagram so um you'll know you'll know then like if you keep watching you'll know what I'm hinting at and you might be able to work it out but that's a super exciting project as well gosh so many exciting projects um but that one's coming to an end so it's nice to have this one to fill in as well and I'm going to stop talking about secret projects now because I know it's so blooming annoying but I actually think you will be excited hello people it is Wednesday and I've been really naughty and not filmed Tuesday or Monday so I'm hoping Grace has I'm editing a video today that I filmed with me and Pete I've got some emails to do, I've got a little bit of work to do, and then I've got a call with Abby, who's my editor, at two, so just like a busy, busy day. Oh, also the girls are here. Hey. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Juno always looks happy. Juno, are you happy? Good morning everybody, um, I've got like a quick errand to run, I've got to go into town and stuff um, and then I've got to pack, um, which is amazing, I'm really excited, I don't know if Amelia said, but we're going to Disneyland, yeah, it's going to Disneyland, going to Disneyland, but I've been really busy this week and so I haven't got anything done, like I've been busy with stuff apart from YouTube, I've got a podcast out, Oh my god guys, I'm so excited for you to see the podcast. If you haven't seen it already, links are down, down in the description. It's with Ryan, it's called Growing Old Together. We've got, uh, our podcast is on, Mia, I'm trying to vlog. Our podcast is on iTunes and Acast. Um, hopefully it'll be on other platforms at some point, but, but Acast is for Android users and iTunes is obviously for Apple users. Um, so hopefully we've covered both platforms there. Any others, comment down below that you want to try and put it on. I know there are a few that you have mentioned to you guys via Instagram. So yeah, I'm really, really excited about that. So I've had quite a busy morning this morning um, trying to put it out. And it's kind of not really gone to plan, but it's all out there now. So now I need to go into town. I need to go and get some euros. Um, I need to go and get some stuff for dinner. I need to get stuff like for packing to take with me, like makeup wipes and things like that. And then I can pack and sit down and answer some emails. Um, and I've got my euros. The exchange rate was ridiculous. It was so bad. I didn't realize how bad it was. I should have ordered them online, but you live and learn. Um, also, I went to Waitrose because that's the supermarket that I can walk to. If we're doing a weekly food shop, then we usually go to Sainsbury's. But if I'm walking into town and I need to do some food shopping, then I usually go to Waitrose. And they have a deal on my favorite product that I use a lot, which are the Nib Nib and Fab uh, Glycolic Fix. I think that's how you say them pads. That I use basically, they look kind of like exfoliate your face and things, but moisturize as well. They actually retexture, resurface, moisturize, refresh, 
acts as a protective layer because the aloe vera and something like that. If I'm honest, someone recommended them to me and they feel amazing. Anyway, I was in Waitrose looking for makeup wipes, which they didn't have, which is fine, to take away with me. Don't usually use makeup wipes, but when I'm going away and I don't have a lot of like storage and stuff, they're a good thing to bring. Um, yeah, they had like a buy one, get one free. So I've got two and I'm gonna try the, oh, the sun's gone. And I'm gonna try the night pads, which is very exciting. We are now on the Eurostar. Um, I'm pretty excited. I'm playing, playing Sims. I should be writing, but I'm playing Sims. But then I'm gonna listen to Grace and Ryan's podcast. Um, and then, yeah. And then I'm probably gonna do writing after. It's like a two hour trip, I got time. We've just been to Disney. We actually only went on a few rides. We went on the Star Tours ride. I went on the Space Mountain ride. Um, we went on a Buzz Lightyear ride, but we haven't actually seen our hotel yet because we, I think we like checked in our luggage at the, um, <coughs> at the train station or something and now it should hopefully be at our hotel but look at our hotel it looks so american even though we're in france i feel like i'm not really like making it look that great but it does look really pretty in front of all the lake and stuff it's crazy we're in our hotel room there's an amelia oh you can't see her really oh I, no that looks weird i'm twerking yeah it didn't look like it it just looked like you were like moving okay. up and down in the bed um i'm gonna be honest guys like I, we haven't vlogged today, but we'll be vlogging to like, we haven't vlogged the park today, but we will vlog tomorrow. But yeah, because we didn't think we were going to be able to really do anything. We got on the train to London Waterloo, and um, then we got a taxi from London Waterloo to King's Cross with my um, Nana and Brian. And then we got the Eurostar from there to here, and um, then we kind of just wandered around the park, just explored a bit. Went on a few rides, but we'll be definitely going on more tomorrow. So we'll probably vlog the park tomorrow rather than today. Today was just more like exploring and things. I have a bed to myself and mum and Amelia are sharing because they've both got colds. Suckers! Um, yeah, yeah. Me, love me on me, and I'm going to and touch Kevin G, I'm a mathly. There's a nerd, there's a verb, so get what you heard in my jeans. Well, the first chicken to the bathroom for something, 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 something. And uh, yeah, I think we're going to go for dinner and then maybe go for a drink somewhere. Ooh, ah, or sleep, one of the two. Good morning, everybody. I'm quite upset, I'm going to be honest. We went to go and find a Corona Eater at Rainforest Cafe last night and couldn't because apparently they don't open just for drinks. <clears throat> They don't know the British ways. Um, but we're going into Disneyland Paris again today, second day. I mean, it's dancing because she wants to be on camera. Um, and I don't know if we're gonna be with all the family or we're splitting up, I'm not really sure. But first of all, we're gonna go and get some breakfast. We're just about to go on the uh, piece of pan ride, but I don't know if you can, we're at the Pirates of the Caribbean thing, and that is where we're going out for dinner tonight. So, oh gosh, it's sunny. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad we found where we're going. But now we're ready to go on the pan ride. So where are we Grace? We're in the Rainforest Cafe, here um, just to get Corona Eater. Yay! Really excited! Yay! I do actually feel a bit dehydrated, I should probably drink some water. Well, it's here, the beautiful Corona Rita. We came so far for you, all the way to France. Oh yeah, there we go. Ooh la la! Amelia, you like? Yeah, the What? It's strong. <laughs> <laughs> so it's Monday and this is the day that we're leaving but for some bizarre reason it's so busy it's the busiest day and like everything seems to be open and everything seems to be open but you can't go on any rides because they're all like Queue. It's just insane. It's a little bit of a shame actually, but you know, there's a reason so many people come here because it's so nice. Um, 
and you know we, we had a good two days of going on rides so we're all groovy so we are now going on it's a small world if you know me which you do but you probably don't know me as well as you don't know five-year-old Amelia. It's a small world used to be my favourite ride. And I, rem I remember when we went to Orlando and it was closed for refurbishment. So I'm really excited to go to It's a Small World. It's also my Nana's favourite ride. We went on this boat ride and we'd be stuck and this guy just keeps going, oh, we're moving. He keeps just going hi-ho and he's done it so many times. Hi-ho. <laughs> what, the duck's having a baby? Laying eggs. So, oh, we've stopped again. You see that? Not that that person, but that. That means we're leaving Disney. Goodbye, Disney. We're really sad. There was a boy on uh, the like the train station going through security, crying, and he was like, "Go, Miss Disney," and I was like, "Same, mate." He's like, "I don't want to go. I don't want to go." But um, it'll be good to go back home to our own beds to see Pete and Ryan and yeah. Wilma and Juno and you know get back into the normal life yeah thank you very much for watching the vlog please make sure you check out my podcast in the description below and we'll see you on Thursday bye bye, bye guys love you